everyone, it's Grace from Grace's Nail Studio, and today I'm going to be doing a little, maybe you could call it kind of a way, creative way of doing a review. It's going to be, I'm going to be comparing Burt's Bees Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream to Sally Hansen's Cuticle Massage Cream. They're basically both cuticle creams, so I'm going to be comparing them today and weighing out the goods and bads and seeing overall which one I like. I have tried both of these, but I'm going to be doing it in a video for you. And I'm going to be doing one hand with Burt's Bees and the other hand with Sally Hansen. So let us get started. I'm going to begin with my Burt's Bees Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream. And oh, it would be so awkward if I cannot open this on camera. Oh, there we go. So... I'm going to take some with my other hand. This stuff is like super greasy and has a really thin consistency. And it smells amazing. I can't tell you how beautiful it smells. It's like heaven. So I just apply it. Hold on, let me get the lighting right. I just apply it on my nail and around my cuticle. Rub it in really good. And so it's just super nice, it's super thin, I really like it, and it feels good on my nails. It's just like, and it smells so good, I can't even tell you. Oh, you have to go and buy some, it's so good. Okay, so it's semi-rubbed in, and I'm going to go ahead and do the other nails. Okay, so as you can see, my nails are greasy. And they have the, from the cuticle cream. And so, now I'm going to take Sally Hansen's cuticle massage cream. <laughs> this one is easier to open. And inside, it looks very different from the Burt's Bees. It looks like cream cheese. But it, like, it's like, it feels exactly like brie cheese. Like, you know, the fancy, I think it's like French cheese. It out <laughs> brie cheese actually happens to be very good, but it looks kind of weird and it feels like brie cheese. So I'm gonna take some. It's kind of hard to get. It's like a. It's kind of has the consistency of like cheese, seriously, and so it's a lot creamier. Like that. So I'm rubbing it on here. It's super thick. Like still pretty. You know, not too bad, but... Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of my nails as well. Okay, so we have the two products. This fi These fingers have Burt's Bees Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream. And these fingers have Sally Hansen's Massage Cream, Cuticle Massage Cream. Now, the difference is that this is very thin, and this is very thick, like it just rubs on thick and I'm telling you I can't tell you how much this has the consistency of cheese like I know you all are gonna think that's hilarious but it does and it's really weird and it's kind of gross when you're putting it on because it's it, like it gets under your fingernails well this one doesn't as much personally between the two okay the big Thing. I'm sure you can already guess. I really like Burt's Bees better between the two. It's easier to rub on. It's oh wait, hold on, let me smell this one. This one smells like a gym. Okay, it has the consistency of cheese, and it smells like a gym. Like, um, like I smelled it. I had this like instant flashback moment to being in a gym, like this specific gym, and it's kind of weird, but. I know. Okay, and so if you can compare their consistencies. Oh, great. I have ugh, the cream on my hand, so I cannot open this. That's why I'm not attempting to do it on camera. So, as you can see, this stuff's super thin, and this stuff is gym smelling in like cottage cheese. Not cottage cheese, brie cheese. And this one is like super thin. They're both pretty good. I mean, I'm sure this one works good. And it's not like it doesn't eat, like it's not like bad for you, I don't think, but I just don't like it as much. And also I find that it gets like in the crevices of my fingers. Like that's what I felt like when I used it last night. 
So personally, between the two, I would have to say that Burt's Bees is better, but not to totally put Sally Hansen's down. But these are two great products. Don't like this one as much, but it works, I guess. And so that's all I have for you guys today. Um, comment below which one you like better, if you have both of them, or if you just have one of them. Tell me if you like it or not in the comments. And if you're sharing this on social media, be sure and use the hashtag Grace's Nail Studio or like Grace's Nail Studio cuticle cream comparison, something like that. You guys can create some fun hashtags to go along with that. I may, I may make a hashtag and put it in the description box below. Along with that, make sure you follow me on Instagram at Grace's Nail Studio. No underscores or periods, nothing like that. Just at Grace's Nail Studio. And be sure and like and subscribe. And I think that's all I have for you. Bye!